Russia plans to reopen international borders by Christmas but detail is slight on. International travel is high on the agenda for many Australians but there is a lot we do not know about how it will work, prompting calls from passengers and the aviation industry for clarity from the federal government. Key points of this news are that the aviation industry wants answers about how and when Australia's international borders will be reopened. Experts say the national plan is too vague and are concerned some states will not follow it. Scraping quarantine is seen as crucial to encouraging inbound tourism. According to the national plan, when 80% of Australians are double vaccinated, there will be a gradual reopening of inward and outward international travel with safe countries, as well as proportionate quarantine and reduced requirements for fully vaccinated inbound travellers. Last week, Tourism Minister Dan Tehan said he hoped international borders would reopen by Christmas at the latest. But while airlines like Qantas have been bullish about selling tickets to London, the US, Singapore, Japan and Canada from mid-December, others in the aviation industry are concerned about how, about the timeline and the uh, lack of clarity about how the reopening will work. Quarantine is another big issue that will affect demand for overseas travel. At the moment, only South Australia and New South Wales have committed to trialling home quarantine.